guys welcome back to my channel I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and you had a wonderful holiday season I know I got some gifts that I wanted to share with you guys but I don't want to sound like I'm bragging or anything so if you don't like this type of video then you're more than welcome not to watch I just wanted to share with you guys kind of like a haul of what I got for Christmas so let's get started so let's start with these this bag I have sitting here I'm gonna be bending down a lot because I have it all sitting on the floor because I can't hold it all in my lap so the first thing I want to talk about is something my husband picked up for me. He knows I love the Snow Angel set, so he picked up the Snow Angel set for me from Philosophy. This has a, a what is this? A shower gel, a body lotion, a body spray, and a polishing scrub. So it has all different types of things in here from the Fallen Snow or the Snow Angel set. I really do love the way this smells. It's got a little bit of haze on this packaging right now because we have the humidifier running in our house. And for some reason that creates a haze on our glass and stuff. So it's got a little bit of a haze. Uh, the next item that I got is something for my mom. So I'm going to kind of flip flop around. This is something for my mom. And she picked up the Hard Candy Trolls Past the Glitter Cream Palette. So here's a little cream palette from the Hard Candy collection. And it's the Trolls. So I'm excited to try this out. I have not tried this yet. So... If you guys have tried this out, let me know what you think of it. I will be doing a little, little bit of a review on this on my channel. So if you're into that type of thing, then just stay tuned. The next thing she picked up was another Hard Candy Trolls. It's the Celebrate Yourself a 15 Color Eyeshadow Palette. So it looks like this. It's got a plastic cover over everything right now. I haven't removed anything. I haven't touched this yet. So I will be doing, like I said, a review on both of these. Then my husband picked up the Bobbi Brown it's the Bobby to Glow Shimmer Brick Palette. So I've been really wanting this. I wasn't sure. I was going to get it during the VIB sale, but then I was like, no. It's kind of pricey, and I don't know if I'm going to like it or not because I heard that it's kind of like a harder scratcher material. But then I've heard that that's just how they are. Oh, wait. You can't even really see it. you got to take these little plastic little things out. So here's what it looks like on the inside. If you've not seen this yet, I will have a review on this also. I know now this is on sale on at Sephora, I believe. So... If you're looking into getting this, I think it's on sale at Sephora right now, so check that out. Then my sister-in-law and my brother picked up a brush set. This is a brush set from the Bliss and Grace collection. It's a 24-piece professional makeup brush set, and it's got wood ferrules, or wood handles, I guess you'd say. So we'll be doing a review on this also. I'm not sure where they got this. I'll have to do a little bit of checking to find out like where this is and how much it is so that we're there. You guys can have some more information on it when I do the review on this. The next thing my husband picked up for me is a set from Tatcha. This is a Tatcha Beauty Essentials Discovery Set. So this is something he got from TJ Maxx. Um, well, let me show you what it looks like on the inside. On the inside, it does have a bunch of different products in here. And again, I will be doing a review on all of the beauty products I will be doing a, a review on to let you know whether or not these products work for me and then if I could recommend them to you. The next two products are from my husband also. He picked up the Tom Ford Black Orchid perfume. I don't think I've ever smelled this before, so when I got it, I was a little surprised by how it smelled. It has a lot of patchouli to it. And then he also picked up the Tom Ford White Patchouli. So I have two different perfumes here from Tom Ford. So I'm excited to have these. The white one I can smell through the box and it it has a, like a little bit of a, um, almost like a cigar scent to it. So it smells good, but it's just a little stronger than I thought it would be. Then he also picked up this Corez set for me. This is the Corez Shower Gel in Classic Fig and the Body Butter in Classic Fig. So I have two products from Corez. Love Corez. I think they have a wonderful skincare line. Then my mother-in-law picked up for me the Clinique Perfume Spray. This is the Clinique Perfume. This is one ounce size. This used to be the perfume that I would use all the time when my kids were little, so it's kind of like a, I don't know, like nostalgic for me, so I really do love this scent. This, is, this was my signature scent, so I was happy to have that back. And then also, I guess since she purchased that, she was able to get the robe from Ulta, so here is the robe. I've got this cute little blue and white robe. I will be hanging in our bathroom so I can use that. And then I guess also something that came with her order, she got a Clinique little lipstick here and then a Clinique lip liner. So here's two little products. So all these products, like I said, I will be doing a review. I'm just kind of going through this quickly because there's a lot to show you guys. So don't want to take too much time. The next thing my husband picked up for me, and this is still in the packaging. I didn't really take it out because I was afraid I was going to mess it up to be honest with you. So let's take it out now so I can show you. This is a little beauty blender keeper. So here's what it looks like. It's got this cute little thing on the top of it. And then it, you put your beauty blender down in here and it does come with a 
it's not an actual beauty blender that it comes with. I think it's like the Sephora brands. It's still Velcro, not Velcro, but like attached. So I won't be attaching that yet. Deattaching that yet. <laughs> so here's what it looks like. I just think it's super cute and it'll be really nice for traveling. I think this comes off. Yeah, you can take him off. So if you just want to travel with just this part and not the crazy little hair dude. So you don't have to have the little crazy hair dude with you when you travel if you don't want to. So that is something my husband picked up for me. And then that is it in this bag. The rest is just little small little samples that came with my mother-in-law's order. And I'll just throw them into Sample Sunday series. Then my husband picked up for me some Alex and Ani bracelets. So I have three Alex and Ani bracelets here that he picked up. I will show you a close-up of each of these. So the first one is the letter J because my husband's name is Joe. So here is what it looks like. Whoops, I'm trying to show you guys. So there is the letter J. And then he picked up also the letter, let me see if I can get these separated, the letter T for Tiffany, of course. So I just think these are super cute. I love Alex and Ani. And then also because our son goes to UVA and then UVA is a school, a school that we really support, he picked up the, I don't know if this one's stuck. So he picked up the UVA one. So I have the UVA one also. So I have those three Alex and Ollie bracelets for my husband, and I really do love these. I love the way they look stacked together. And then also I have all of my other pieces from Alex and Ollie. Most of them are the same color, so I can wear these with those pieces that I already own. My son picked up for me for Christmas. He knows I love pictures. He knows I love, like, videoing and things like that. So I picked up this cute little coffee cup. I mean, this is so adorable. It looks exactly like a camera lens, I think. And then it twists off, and then it's got the little spot at the top where you can use to get your drink out it's just been washed so it's a little bit wet still but it's super cute it's even got like the auto fo auto focus and the manual focus little buttons down here i just think this is super adorable now my husband also picked out for me swagger sorry guys i'm gonna be bending down like i said he got me the this new coach purse i love the design on this purse i think it's super beautiful i think it's a very pretty color i love the black with the red flowers it looks very valentine's like and then he got a little purse that goes with this so like if you don't want to carry your big purse into stores with you you can carry just this one and then it also he bought me a new wallet so the wallet looks like this so here's the wallet that goes with the purse and then also gosh it's a lot in here and then also just a little pouch here and this is usually what i keep like gum and stuff in so here's another little pouch so all of those things came together so that i can use this in combination and it was really funny because i had just bought an umbrella before we went to new york and here's the umbrella that i bought and it's so coincidental how much they match that is so cute so that is a, pa a purse that my husband picked up for me from the brand coach I really do like this. I love the way it looks. I think it's a very pretty design. Now, let's see. He picked up for me, or actually, I'm going to pause you guys for just one second, and I'm going to grab a stack of clothing, and I'll start showing you the clothing and the different things like that. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I grabbed all of my clothes that I have from Christmas. So I have them here in my lap. I'm hoping that I'll be able to show these to you without <laughs> making this whole pile fall off my lap. So I'm saving the best item that I got for Christmas for last, but I'm also going to talk about some items that I don't have with me to show you. They're just pictures I'll, start, I'll insert, so I'll talk about those. So the first item I want to talk about is a jewelry box that my husband got for me. So I'll, I will insert a picture here so you can see the jewelry box. So beautiful. I've been wanting a nice jewelry box. I have a lot of the like the costumey type jewelry, so I wanted something to store all that in. That's not like everywhere. Before I had a bunch of smaller jewelry boxes and it was just, it was hard to find things. So he picked up this gorgeous jewelry box for me for Christmas. And then also the other thing that he picked up for me was, hang on, I'm trying to remember everything. Oh, this really cute little lamp. This cute lamp I actually have sitting over here on my vanity. Super, super cute. I love the way it looks. It's got these little crystals all over it. I was insert a picture of that also. So it's a very beautiful little lamp. And then the last thing that I have a picture of, what is the last thing I have a picture of? Uh, I'm having to think for a second. Anyway, I can't remember what the other thing is, but I will insert a picture of the other thing. I don't remember right offhand what it was. Is that terrible or what, guys? Oh, I know. It's a little, at, like an atomos. Is it atomos? No. It's something that, like, fragrances your house with those different oils, essential oils. So I got one of those for our room. I really enjoy using that because I have really a lot of sinus pressure, and I think the peppermint really helps with that sinus pressure. So he got me that, and I really do love that. So the first clothing item he picked up for me, actually, is this cute sweater right here. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it into the complete frame or not. But the neck on this sweater kind of folds down. And then it ties right here. So it's like the 
enlarged like cow neck or whatever I guess that's what you call it um he picked this up from Eddie Bauer so this is a cute sweater that I can wear in the winter I love sweaters so you're gonna see a lot of sweaters here coming up but like I said I'm saving the best item for last so I'll show you guys that the next sweater he picked up looks like this I would love to do a try on if you guys would like for me to do a try on haul of these I definitely can but this is another sweater from Eddie Bauer this one here looks like <laughs> I'm trying to show you guys Here's what it looks like. It's just a nice long sweater and then it's got these cute sleeves that cuff and then it's just a very, it's like a grandpa type sweater I guess you call it. Really do love these style of sweaters because I think they're very comfortable. And then he picked up some pants. I love like these um, different colors of pants. So I've got a green pair and these are by the brand Buffalo. So I just really like the way that these feel on and then, so there's what they look like. They're just a green color. And then he also picked up the black pair. So I have a black pair of pants. And then I guess this is like a camel color. So he picked up the camel color of pants. And like I said, I can do a try on haul if you'd like to see a try on of any of these clothing items. And then my mom got me this cute sweater right here. Here's what it looks like. This is what the sweater it looks like. It's super, super gorgeous. I love the way the sweater looks. So, so pretty. I love how it like drapes over like this and it's got this faux leather looking design right here. That's so pretty. It looks like Valentine's for me, I think. And then my mom also got me this sweater right here. So, so cute. I love the, the detail around the neck on this one. And this is by Calvin Klein. She got it in a size medium. I like my sweaters to be a little bit larger. I don't like them to be tight. I typically can wear a small, but I like them a little bit looser. So, hoping this will be loose. So I have gained a little bit of weight over the holiday season eating all those cookies and stuff. So it may not be as loose as I thought it would be. And then she also got me this sweater right here. This is just a long, I'm not sure what you call it, but it's just a very long sweater. And then it's got the back detail to it. It's like, I don't know, it's just a really cute sweater. Really love it. It's like a nice thin sweater. And then my mother-in-law got me, oh goodness. She got me this sweater right here. And this is by the brand Calvin Klein also. And again, it's on a medium because I like my sweaters to be baggy. So you can wear them with leggings if you'd like to. Or you can wear them with jeans, however you choose to do. And then my husband got me this sweater right here. This is probably one of my favorites that I got for Christmas. I just love the grandpa style sweaters. I think they're so comfortable and you can almost wear them with anything. So here is the grandpa style sweater. I love this one. This one is just so, so cute. We actually, he ended up getting this one in an extra small because it runs a little bit bigger. So really do like the way it looks. So it's so, so cute. And then he picked up this blanket scarf for me. This is a black, white, and red blanket style scarf. So here's the black and white side. And then if you flip it, you have the black, white, and red side. So you have two different colors right here. I really do love this. The black and red is the color of my son's football team. So this is something I know I'll be utilizing a lot because it's our school colors. And then he also picked up this super cute vest. I love this vest. I'm not even sure where he picked this up from because it's from a brand called Marikiti. Not even sure. Really do think this is super cute though. I can't wait to try this on with a pair of jeans and some thick, like tall boots or whatever. And then he got me some socks. These are, what are these called? They're called Fireside Lounge Socks. So here is the red and white pair of Fireside Lounge Socks. I think they're very adorable. And then he also got me this black, white, black and red. I was going to say black, white, and red. I was thinking of my scarf still. So he got me this black and red pair, the checkered style. I really do think these are cute too. I love those style of socks because they feel so nice and cozy on your feet. And then another sweater that my husband picked up for me is this one right here from Eddie Bauer. And it looks like this. It's got a little bit of a hood on the back. It's just a very pretty design on the sweater. Again, we got it in a, he got it in a medium because he knows I like my sweaters to be a little bit more comfortable. And then he got me these thermal pants. I love thermal pants. I don't like, know about you guys, but I love thermal pants. These have black and red on the inside and then they're jean material. But where we live, it gets pretty cold and thermal pants come in. I guess these are thermal or they're flannel lined. Flannel lined. Flannel line pants, I love the way these look. Um, I think they're very, very comfortable on, so I can't wait to wear these. And then at the bottom, you can cuff the bottoms up so that they have the black and red on the bottom. Super, super cute. 
I'm actually going to pause you guys for one more second and I'm going to go grab the candles that my mom got me. My mom got me, I think, a lot of candles. So I'm going to go get those and then I'll show you guys the candles that she got me. And then the last thing will be the big item that my husband got me. So hang tight, guys. I'm back. Sorry about that. I wanted to just share the candles that my mom had picked up for me for, me for Christmas. She knows this is one of my major items that I love every year for Christmas. So she kind of goes a little bit overboard on the candles and I absolutely love it that she does because this is something I can t continue to use throughout the year. I like the more fall and winter scents. I'm sure you guys have heard before on my channel, if you're, if you're familiar with my channel. Um, so she picked up this giant bag of candles for me for Christmas. So I'm going to show you the candles that she picked out for me. So the first scent is a marshmallow fireside because you guys, I don't know if you know or not, but this is my favorite scent out of all the candles that Bath and Body Works sells. I love this scent right here. This scent is like a heavenly scent to me. Love, love, love. What are the notes on this one? <laughs> the notes are... Um, toasted marshmallow, sumptuous vanilla cream, and the comforting aroma of smoldering wood. Love this candle so, so much. The next scent she picked up for me is Tis the Season, and Tis the Season looks like this. Super cute. I like the little glass, little Christmas balls around it. Super cute. Tis the Season smells just like Christmas, so if you want a Christmas candle that smells a lot like Christmas, I'm going to try to stack these and not touch them and have them fall over. Then she picked up Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. This one's got a cute little, um, what is that? A turkey. I couldn't think. I was going to say eagle. It's got a cute little turkey on the top. And this one smells really, really nice too. It smells like cinnamon, but not overpowering cinnamon. Because overpowering cinnamon I can't handle because it tends to give me a headache for some reason. So that one's not overpowering. It looks like I might have two of those too. Yes, I have another one here. Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. Again, with a cute top with the turkey on it. And then she picked up the scent... Tis the season again, and this is a different container. So there's different containers I'm thinking that uh, Bath and Body Works had. So this one's got the Christmas tree top lid, but the other one did too. So they both have the cute little lid. So I guess it just depends on what kind of bottle you wanted with it. So Then she also got the scent Sweater Weather. This is another one that's a very, very nice scent. The scent to this one is Fresh Sage, Juniper Berry, Aromic aromatic eucalyptus, and fresh wood. So it's another one that's a very nice scent for the winter. And then she picked up Fresh Sparkling Snow. And Fresh Sparkling Snow is Sparkling Sugarberry, Icy Melon, and Holiday Pear. Yum. And then she picked up the scent Pumpkin Woods. Again, like you guys know, I love the more fall winter scents. This, is, this one is Woodland Spruce, Cedar, Clove Buds, and Smoky Vanilla. And then she also picked up this one here. Look at the jar on this one. That one's so pretty. I love the jar. This one is chestnut and clove, and the scent notes are roasted chestnut, clove buds, pine, cedarwood, velvety moss. So, I had not smelled this one before. It has a little bit of a, a guy scent. It smells a little bit like a guy's cologne. So, if you like the guy's cologne scent, you might enjoy that. So, the next one is vanilla pumpkin marshmallow, and the notes on this one is creamy vanilla, pumpkin spice, homemade marshmallow, and drizzled caramel. So that one, again, has a nice cute little lid on it. I love the, the lids to these. I like to depot my candles. If you guys would ever be interested in seeing me how to depot a candle, let me know because I can definitely do that. This one looks like it may have melted or something. Not sure. This is spiced vanilla marshmallow. No, it's just the jar. Okay, I was like, what in the world? The jar is like all like that. So this one has... Spice vanilla marshmallow and the notes are, I think I added the lid to this because I like for my all of my candles to have a lid, so I had extra lids. So this one says it is creamy vanilla, fresh ground clove, homemade marshmallow. So this one smells really, really nice and I like the jar of that one. That one would be really beautiful, depotted, as well as this one. And I did add the lid to this one as well. And this is spicy vanilla, spice vanilla marshmallow again. So here's what the jars look like to those though. The jars are a little bit, they almost look like they're like ceramic, not ceramic, but um, I don't know. They just look really pretty. I'm not, I'm not even sure how to describe the way that they look. They're very, very pretty. So all in all, she got me 12 candles. I'm absolutely happy. I love candles. I love burning them. I love the way they make my house smell. I, I think it just makes your house smell a little bit more homey when you have a candle burning and then people come to your house. I just think it makes it feel very comforting. So for me, this is something I always enjoy and look forward to every year that my mom gets me is a ton of candles. So I have this giant bag of candles love those so now we're at the big gift so let's start with the bag that the big gift can go into so my husband picked up this huge bag here this is a backpack style bag that you can carry your camera in and this is the low pro style 
and it does have zippers and everything on the outside and on the inside. And then you open this up. I'm gonna try to do this so that I don't drop anything. So open this up and then on the inside you have your product. So the item that he got me that I'm super excited about that we will be starting to film with is the Canon 70D. So he picked up the Canon 70D for me for Christmas. Love this camera. This is like so, I was so happy to get this. You guys cannot even imagine. I am just elated with happiness. I feel so blessed this Christmas. I have gotten so many great things from people and my husband definitely spoiled me. He got me so many great things that I can't even, I can't even describe how nice and sweet he is to me. I just, I feel like, I honestly feel like he just, I don't know, he spoils me. I guess that's all I can say. He spoils me. The other thing I forgot to insert a picture of is this cute little vanity chair that's sitting behind me. So it's a cute, it's a, um, it has the low back to it. I can't remember how, like, I don't know the name of it or anything, but I will insert a picture of the vanity chair so you can see what the vanity chair looks like. I just remember that because I'm sitting right here beside of it. I don't know why I didn't think of that earlier, but this camera itself is so, so nice. I can't wait to record with this. This one, because it is the 70D, will autofocus. So I'm going to be able to use this for, to record videos and be able to still autofocus and show you guys products. So I'm excited to try this out for videoing. And then also it's going to be perfect for our family pictures. I had another Canon. I had the Kevin D. Kevin D. I had the Canon T3i, and I'm, I went ahead and passed that on to my oldest son so that he can use that for taking pictures. He loves it, so he's absolutely happy with it. And I feel like you know, whenever I get a new one, I like to pass my last one that I was using down to him, and then we pass the one that he was using down to my youngest son. That way, there we kind of cycle the cameras through the family, and they get good use. So I do have this nice camera now, though. This is so so nice. I love this camera. I love the lens to it and then what did he get me with that he got me an extra battery with it this case to put it in and then also this nice new tripod so this is the new tripod that he got for me to use for videoing and also for family pictures and things like that so I'm excited to have these great products I cannot wait to put these to use for for you guys to show you guys how the, the video quality is hopefully it will be good I'm not sure how to use it yet. I'm still learning on this camera. I'm not too familiar with it. So I'm still going to be learning for a little bit before I try putting it to use. I hate to start trying to use it and then the video quality is not right because I don't know what I'm doing. So that is everything that I got for Christmas. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'd love to hear what you guys forgot for Christmas. I'd love to know what you guys picked up for yourself or maybe people got for you or what you got others. I'd love to hear. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday and I hope you guys have a wonderful new year. Thank you so much and I'll catch you guys next time.